If scuba diving places that the average person just doesn't want to go to interest you, start now by subscribing to my channel because that is exactly what I do here. What's going on everybody? My name is Jeremy. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm back out at the train bridge. I got a hot tip yesterday that a John boat flipped about eight years ago here and the guy gave me the location where the boat flipped. He said that he dropped a shotgun. So I'm gonna start in that area and see what I can find. Maybe he dropped some other cool stuff. We're gonna see what we can find. We're gonna look all around this bridge and see what other kind of cool stuff we can find. And let's start right now. Where are your gloves? Ah. What's in it? What you got there? I didn't even look. Oh, it's a full backpack. <laughs> I can see. See what's sticking out? What? You know? Is that a plastic knife? No. It's a plastic duck. <laughs> I can see its head. Okay, ready? Here we go. Whoop! <laughs> Quack. <laughs> Who has a duck in their backpack? A decoy. It may be a, a duck hunter's bag. Oh, yeah, definitely nice. a decoy. We'll go through the rest of it later on. Hey, we caught a fish underwater. Thank you. 
I didn't find a gun. But is that a big knife? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's my cue to get out. Let's get to the house. See what we found. Back at the house, let's check out some of the stuff that I found. Now besides all the stuff that you did already see in the video, I did not end up bringing it home. A lot of stuff got thrown away. A lot of stuff got left behind. So let's check out some of the finds. So I did crack open that backpack and I was absolutely correct. It is a duck decoy. Had the little wings that flap. It looks pretty expensive because it's battery operated. You can open his butt and see that there's a big battery in there. The legs move, I guess the wings flap. Brings in the other ducks. That's pretty cool. I also found this extremely old looking machete. Probably not that old, but it has been sitting there a while because because most of it's rotted away. That's pretty cool. A lot of stuff I didn't bring home because I just didn't have the room this time, but I am gonna be back out there again and I'm gonna start collecting more of the stuff that I find and bring it home so I can show you guys. As you can see behind me, I'm getting a very good collection of stuff just laying around my front yard and my wife's not enjoying it. So I gotta kinda tone that down a little bit, but believe me when I say the trash I'm finding is going in the trash can and all the cool finds are coming home with me. But until next time, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you subscribe and I will see you again.